Oh my gosh, it came. Two days ago, I ordered some LPS from this one seller off eBay and um, it came today. So I am super excited. And I actually ordered two sets, not sets, but two bundles of LPS from the same seller in the same day. So I don't know which this one is. I ordered two Cocker Spaniels and five German Shepherds. So I don't know which one it is. And that's why my background is white because usually I choose my backgrounds to match my LPS, but I don't know which LPS I'm getting in this box. So let's just, let's just open it. Here it is. Yeah, I know it's kind of hard to see with a white background and a white box, but let's open it. I don't know how I'm gonna do this, so let's just start tearing things up. I'm sorry if you can't see it. I don't know what I'm doing. I might just, I might as well break the LPS before I even get them open, so, you know. And here we go. Okay. They are, oh, they're the Cocker Spaniels. Oh, and the German Shepherd. Oh, there's both. Okay, so the Cocker Spaniels and German Shepherds are in this. Okay, so I got rid of the bubble wrap and the Cocker Spaniels and German Shepherds are each in their own bags. So I'm just gonna start with the German Shepherds. Okay, here we go. Oh boy. All right, you guys, here they are. These are them. Oh my gosh, I am literally crying right now. Ah. 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 That was a happy cry, just so you know I'm not dying. All right, well, continue watching if you'd like to see each of these LPS with more detail. If not, and you just wanna go ahead and see the Cocker Spaniels, uh, I will put a number right here. Uh, that number will show you where to go in the video, so skip to that point in the video to go ahead and see the Cocker Spaniels, but now we're going to go into full detail on the German Shepherds. This one is number 112, or 112. This is LPS number 867, or 867 number 744 or 744, number 1191 or 1191, and this guy is number 491 or 491. All right, I'm gonna start with this girl because why not? She definitely needs a bath because if you look closely at her forehead, I don't know if the camera will show it, but there are some like little tiny red marks, um, like right there, if you can see it, it makes her look angry. They look like angry eyebrows. So it makes her look a little funny with it. And her chin, her chin is also a little scuffed up. Sorry, my hair was in the way for a second. Her chin's also a little scuffed up and it looks like there's stuff in her ear and in the crack in her feet, it's definitely a little dirty. But overall, she is pretty nice, but she just needs a wash. And now this one, her number is number 1191 or 1191. I think out of my five new German Shepherds, I think she is my favorite. I love her colors, how they go together. She is a lot cleaner than um, number 112, but yeah, I just love her colors. and. Her different style of eyelashes, I've never seen those types of eyelashes before. I just think they're creative and cool, and I like the purple in her eyes going with the different shades of brown. It's just like the different browns together and the purple, It's it just comes together so nice. Again, her ears look like they might have something in them. I don't know if you can see it. It's definitely not as much stuff in them as the other one. But yeah, she's in better condition. And then there's this pet. It is number 491 or 491. And honestly, this pet would seem like a boy to me. I really don't see any girl traits about him. But yeah, he's in pretty good condition. I mean, great condition except for one little area on his neck. It's just a little scratched up. 
but I really don't think it's that big of a deal because it's a very minor detail that nobody's really going to ever see on the pet in videos unless like they're dead but still it's a minor detail it's not going to be seen I really love this pet it's in great condition and then we have number 744 or 744 um I like this character a lot because just her look her style her different unique colors and weird eyelashes I mean they create a cool character for her like a bouncy bubbly kind of stylish personality trait so I could see that for her it'd be an awesome character to have at my studio and like I really have some great ideas for her and I really cannot wait to use her to make videos and now our last pet in the box, LPS number 867 or 867. And honestly, I think this one is in the best condition out of all of them. Uh, it only has one tiny little neck scrape, which I don't think will be noticed at all. And really, to me, this pet just looks like a brown version of the white and blue snow German Shepherd. I don't own this snow German Shepherd, but I've seen it before. And this one just looks like a brown version again i love the purple with all the different shades of brown this pet is so pretty it's very similar to this one because of the purple eyes and different shades of brown and that's just this one just reminds me of the snowy german shepherd all right it is time to open up the cocker spaniels Woo! okay so i took these two beautiful new um cocker spaniels out of the bag and here they are this is lps number 91 and this is number 79 you might recognize these two as jenny and rachel from lps popular okay well these cocker spaniels are so pretty and i am so excited and happy to have them and now I am going to go into full detail about what they look like and their state and um, any marks they might have. But if you don't want to watch that, again, I will leave a number right here. Um, skip to that point in the video to go ahead and see the outro. Alright, I'm going to start with number 79. I ended up naming her Eliza, so this is Eliza. She's in really good condition, except for maybe that one spot. I don't know if you can see it on her ear, if the camera will show it. There's like one little spot that's a lot lighter than her fur. But really, I don't think it's too big of a deal. There might, There's also some dark spots right there. Again, I don't know if you can see it. And it's really not that big of a deal. So, because it's really small, the camera is never really going to show it in videos. People aren't going to see it. So, overall... She is in pretty good condition, no marks, blemishes, she's just so beautiful and I really love the ombre white on her forehead, that's, that is just pretty. Oh my gosh, this pet is in the best condition. Unfortunately, this pet was not in as good of condition as number 79 was. This one is number 91 and I ended up naming her Lynn, L-Y-N-N. -N. But she is not in the greatest condition because you can probably already tell that her nose, the paint on her nose is a little chipped so I might have to repaint that and there's a little purple mark on her eye. I don't know how to get rid of that and if the camera will show it, it looks like there's a little pinkish reddish mark in her fur up there. It's going to be hard to get because it's in like the little cracks up there and it looks like highlighters. So I don't even know if I'll be able to get that out at all. She also has some really weird two black dots, one on her cheek and one on her ear, if you can see that. And her feet, like the area in her feet, the cracks, has so much dirt, if you can see all this dirt. Yeah, it's definitely not the most hygienic pet because it's very dirty and that's going to be really hard to get out and her neck is also a little rusty if you can see the rust it's not 
too terribly bad, but it's pretty rusty, and that's going to be a handful to wash. So yeah, Lynn is not in the best condition, but she is still an amazing pet to have, and I'm so happy to get her. Alright, well, these are all of my new pets that I received in the mail today, and oh my gosh, I'm so happy! <laughs> Well, I think I'm going to end the video here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Comment down below what you think and what LPS you liked most out of my seven new characters. So, yeah. Thank you for watching. Bye!